Whoa, bonjour, je m'appelle Microsoft Surface Laptop. Yes. Bon. Let's take a look at this sucker. Alright, so we have Microsoft Surface Laptop 2, 8th Gen i7, 256 gig, 8 gig RAM. Nice, nice. Let's open her up and see what's on the inside. It's hard to do one handed. Maybe I should use my tripod. Alright, so there we go. Ooh, very nice. I like the box too. I like the packing job quite a bit. So I've handled many surfaces before, but never exactly a surface laptop. And then of course in here you get your information, no stickers unfortunately, and your power, but really who cares about that? Very nice, smooth, cold to the touch, metal. You've got uh, one USB, I think it's DVD. Whoa, 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 only one USB connector. I guess I, I should know that. I mean, then again, I would have thought the laptops would have been a bit better off. So, let's take a look at the inside. Interesting. Fuzzy keyboard, even though it doesn't detach. It definitely doesn't detach, but yeah, it's a fuzzy keyboard. I don't know why they went with that. And the power button right there. Yeah, so, let's uh, turn on the juice and see what shakes loose, right? All right, nice background, nice screen. Very reflective though, and probably very easily broken. I had a user drop one of these once, and uh, yeah, that <laughs> was interesting. All right, so I'm gonna be doing some automatic offline updates, and I'm also going to be uh, setting this thing up with nightnight.com. Let's hope this thing goes just as quick as I thought it would. Alright ladies and gentlemen, let the benchmark begin. Like usual, we're using Passmark uh, Performance Test uh, 9.0. And I'll show you the video sections, but generally people aren't too interested in uh, this regular like floating point math stuff. So I'll show you at the end. Alright. We've got the planes. Generally these things will go around as fast as they can. So honestly, that's not, uh, that's not bad. 73 frames per second. We're not getting, uh, we're not getting nerfed. We're definitely not getting nerfed by uh, the multiplier. Yeah, so that's definitely not very fast, 7 frames per second. So, definitely not made to be a video game machine, but I think that, uh, I think we can live without it being a video game machine. Since the thing is unbelievably, uh, this thing's unbelievably light. So it's pretty fast for the, for the speed. I've definitely seen better and I've definitely seen worse, but I'm not too concerned. You definitely see the very reflective uh, monitor here while I do this. I don't see that on too many of my other units. But as long as you're not in a fiercely bright place, you should be just fine, I think. So I bet you can play Fortnite on this, but not much else. As you can see, we're getting a bit sketchy there. Not the best.
All right, so it's looking pretty good. I'm pretty impressed. That is uh, 3,185.6 overall. Let's see, okay. Oh wait, that's not a Lenovo. It is a Surface Laptop 2. Upload so they can see what your system is, okay. Yeah, so not looking too bad. Especially compared, especially compared to the, uh, the Surface 6, I think it was, I had in here lately. Not too bad. Not too bad. I've seen better, but, uh, definitely not in this size. So let's talk a little bit about the frame of this unit. I do really like it. Ultimately, very light. A little heavy, con uh, considering... Uh, the size. It could be a little lighter, but still, I don't think anyone's really complaining. There's a fan in here. I can't feel the air, but you can hear it if you put it up to your... Oh, maybe I can right about there. Right about over there. But the unit feels really nice. It feels like the cooling system is done uh, with the little fan and then with the aluminum outer shell or whatever you want to call it. All in all, that's say it's definitely a win. It's good stuff. Anyways, like and subscribe if you like the stuff. Always appreciate it. And uh, catch you later, folks. Have fun.